We're going to dive deeper into some next-gen stats. These are things that analytics-driven guys like the Browns trust and uh, front office and coaches really dig into and kind of like. They base some things on. First one we're going to look at is uh, the fastest ball carrier for 2019 season. These are on individual plays. It was Matt Breida who went over 22 miles an hour on an 83-yard touchdown run. Yep, that was the one against the Browns uh, where he went 83 yards and started that. Uh, but you look down a little further and Nick Chubb, uh, almost 22 miles an hour on an 88-yard touchdown run. That one was against the Ravens, fourth fastest in the NFL. And Nick Chubb doesn't get credit as being a speedster. And then Odell Beckham, uh, 21.7 miles an hour on an 89-yard touchdown reception. That was against the Jets in the Monday night game early in the year. Uh, let's welcome Dan Lobby back in. Dan, that uh, that speaks to uh, pretty impressive speed. And those aren't the only guys that can move. So that might be a, an area of the Browns might get underlooked a little bit. You know, Nick Chubb is is sneaky fast. You go back and watch that run against Baltimore, and, and it's pretty incredible how quickly he turns on the Jets and just leaves everybody behind. But he had a couple of runs against Oakland his rookie year like that. He had that 92-yarder against the Falcons uh, where he got to that second level and was just gone. I, I think that's why it's, it's so exciting to think about Nick Chubb in this offense where you're going to have some holes for him to run through, and it's going to sort of suit his – you know, one cut and go, he's going to get to that second level and he's going to put some big runs up. There is speed on this football team. You know, Chubb, Kareem Hunt, Odell Beckham. You know, Jarvis Landry is not the fastest guy in the world, but he knows how to get open. He, he kind of works around like that. Uh, Donovan Peoples-Jones is a guy that if they can figure out ways to maybe get him on the field, you don't want to put too high of expectations on a sixth round pick in his rookie year, but uh, he's a guy that could help them in the return game. Same with, a you know, a JoJo Natson if, if he makes the roster. They've got some speed on this football team. And, and, you know, what does everybody like to say? You can't teach speed. You, you just sort of have it or you don't. And, and the Browns have some guys that can move. It's incredible it, when it, you think 22 miles an hour is what he's approaching running, both of them. I mean, put that in perspective. Next time you're on a treadmill, put it up to 10 <laughs> miles an hour, and it's twice that fast. I mean, just think about that for a minute. You're going... If you're on a t treadmill that's going 22 miles an hour, you're flying to the back of the wall behind you. Yeah, and you know, think about doing that for you know however many yards, 50 yards, 60 yards, with guys chasing you and and you know trying to trying to take you down. It's pretty unbelievable how fast these guys can get moving.